All right, so I have a little test scene here with a plane. It's strafing from left to right, and we're spawning enemies and upgrades. Once we're interacting with these enemies or upgrades, we will see something in our console. As you can see, these statements uh, show us the information we want, but it's not showing all information we could be seeing. What if we have uh, lots of upgrades or enemies we might want to see? where these statements are actually coming from. So if we take a look at the enemy script and I change this to debug, I will also do this for the upgrade. We will now see in our console, not only the information, but also the enemy script with the line number and the method. Now we know on which point something was happening. So we can put a breakpoint there. Well, now we will be brought to the point where our code is halted and we can actually see extra information of objects we are currently seeing in the scene. Something else we can do is we can push warnings. This will show them in our actual debugger console. We can also do this with push error. For example, if you have something that is game breaking, not per se that Godot is crashing, but you really want this not to happen, you can push an error. All right, I hope this helps you with your debugging in the future. Bye bye.